Yeah, good day. Um, I just finished that project out the back for Katie, her hut. And uh, the day before yesterday, I went to Scotty Brown's and he fitted me up from a road bike. And he said I had all the settings were all wrong. And um, so I took it for his first, first ride yesterday up Mount Pleasant out the Godly Head. And oh, fantastic. What a difference, you know, absolutely brilliant. And uh, the carbon wheels on it, it is fantastic. So today, I uh, woke up real early, I thought oh, I'll do a 150k ride, you know, <laughs> and uh, because I've been getting sore biceps because the, um, the bars were too far out and all my weight was going on, so I wanted to give it a good test. So I let, started riding at quarter past five, and I found a new cycle track, and I went out there, and I was biking into Kaipoi, and they had the cones on the road, and the road was a bit narrow, and I see where they're sealed for the new bike lane over to the left. And I um, was thought, oh, I'll get up onto that, you know. And um, and then the part that I went up on it, um, they put a bloody curb there. I didn't see the curb because it was a wee bit dark. And I hit the curb. I was doing 30 k's an hour. And I hit the curb and I went down, man. Far out. And um, shit, I thought I broke my collarbone. Um, grazed the shit out of my leg. Here's my... All this shit down here. Um, yeah, anyway. I was bloody stunned. <laughs> yeah, because it happened so bloody fast. So um, I rang my daughter. Of course, she didn't pick up the phone. It was about 20 to 6 in the morning. So I rang my son-in-law, and then um, he picked up the phone. Oh, no, actually, Della picked up the phone. And so he came out and got me. And um, bloody blood all over the place. <laughs> Anyway, they took me in the hospital and they x-rayed me and I haven't broken anything. So I'm pleased about that because, shit, this is the time of the year where I want to be doing, you know, tramping and bloody fishing and bloody biking and surfing. And this is the time of year where it all happens. So, so um, I'm out of action. I don't know for how long, uh, but because nothing's broken, that's bloody, I'm so pleased about that. And um, so uh, there's one of the tendons in there, or a few of them. There's a cluster. Ah, shit. Ooh, bloody sore. There's a cluster of tendons in here. And I can move it forward and back. But I, oh, I can't do that. <laughs> yeah, all these things. So um, oh, hopefully it'll heal quickly because uh, I've got a lot of things to do. So anyway, that's just the life, isn't it? But I must say... Um, the setup, what a difference the setup is on the bike, you know, it's fantastic. Anyway, because um, that's all right. And I'm working on a new camera system um, for mainly for day walks um, or day tramps. Uh, it'd be really, really good. Um, it uses the phone and bike holders and phone holders and bloody selfie sticks and tripods. And um, I'll, when I get it sorted, I'll make a video of that because I think it's a bit of a revolution. And I've just sourced this bloody wireless microphone, you know, because wind noise is a bloody pain in the ass. So um, this wireless microphone's coming over from the States, and I'll have to shove that in my pocket. So when I get the system up and running, I'm going to make a video and show how to um, make really good YouTube videos out in the bush. You know, simple, quick procedure. Um, yeah, so that's coming. But in the meantime, it's get over this bloody shoulder bullshit and get back into that saddle and start riding again. Yeah. Anyway, just a quick one there. Okay. Never life just keeps on trucking. Yeah, it goes on. <laughs> okay. See ya.